we're not allowed to have photographs taken because we work in the aviation industry. We're not allowed to have photographs unless it's been permitted. So welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're here at Collins Aerospace in Leighton Buzzard. And these make some sort of military aircraft, maybe drones, I don't know. Trespassers will be prosecuted. Well, we won't be going on. Use of cameras and other audio and image recording device is restricted. Wow. We'll see about that, won't we? But the building, oh, building number one, doesn't look that fancy. Got a bit of mold growing on the side of it, look. But it is Friday, so I think most of the people here have left for the day. I don't think there's any activity at all at reception. So let's continue having a look around. There is some sort of gatehouse security box there, but nobody's in it. And a few vehicles dotted around with building number two over on the right. So what else can we see from the outside? A little bit of a layout there. You go in building one on the left, two on the right, go around the back to number four and three. Nice and simple. But then they get a little bit cheeky and they start saying no fly zone for drones. Flying within 500 feet of this property is prohibited. Well, with a 249 gram drone, we can fly as close as we like. Well, it doesn't even say fly within, it says fly with 500 foot of this property. Fly with? The sign don't even make sense. Illegal drugs, alcohol and weapons are prohibited. Use of cameras and other audio and image recording devices restricted by policy, yet your policy, policy is only enforced on your land. So they're making a big deal about policy and rules. I just hope they don't try and enforce those rules on the members of the public on the outside. Because we can't be having that, can we? A coffee van just pulled over. Do they want us? DJ Audits. Hello, mate. <laughs> what was your first name? Mike. Mike. Thanks for watching, mate. No worries, mate. Thank you. I'll let you go. Cheers, Mike. Mike from Really Awesome Coffee. Franchise is available. <laughs> I'll pop your details up on the screen now, Mike. So if you do want a franchise, get in contact with him. So this sign here does say that the site closes at half one on Fridays and it is quarter past two now. So we'll jump straight into this one. We'll get David out and see what this place looks like from above. As always, we've checked on drone assist. There are no flight restrictions in this area. They've got lots of signs telling the members of the public what to do. But as we all know, we ignore signs which are only in force when people are on your site, when you're out on a public footpath. Only the law applies to you. And the law states that as long as there are no flight restrictions in place, which you can check using drone assist, you have the operator ID displayed on your drone. You have line of sight and you fly safely. Then you're perfectly entitled to film, fly over, whatever you like. So, most staff finish at half one here. So we're not gonna see a lot. We're not gonna see a lot at all, look. Lots of empty car parks. No goods, 
visible. No movement at all. A nice hidden area down the back here though. So if there is going to be any exciting goods being loaded, I expect it will be done down here. We have got security down there, look. We have a skip that is covered over with a couple of tanks. A forklift outside there, ready to pick up an IBC. Lots of mopped pedestrian footways. So health and safety is very much on their mind here. A very secure site with an electric gate and two further traffic barriers and no solar panels at all. We have got one vehicle left on site with its rear doors open. Just looks like an empty van to me. Sorry? Can you tell us what you're doing? No. You can't tell me. So, what are you asking? I'm asking, you're flying a drone, a drone above our property. Can you tell us what you're doing? You've just said it. Sorry? You've just said it. You've said it? You've just said what I'm doing. I don't get what you're asking me. I'm asking you what you're doing flying a drone outside our property. It's a bit loud. I don't know if you want to come out or not. Okay, I can meet you there. Hello, mate. My name is Danny. I'm the senior operations manager here. Right. So I'm just asking what you're doing flying a drone outside over, over the top of our property. Yeah, exactly that. Just flying a drone, just taking some yeah, shots. Yeah, but, but why? I just want to make a little video about the place. Okay, so we're not allowed to have photographs taken because we work in the aviation industry. We're not allowed to have photographs unless it's been permitted. So your, your drone was above our, above our facility. What, what are you going to do with that? I don't understand what you're saying to me. What do you mean you don't allow it? We, do, we don't allow pictures or anything of our property. So I need to understand what you're going to do with that footage. That's a ridiculous statement. No, it's not a ridiculous statement. It is. You, you, I'm you, just asking you a simple question is what are you going no, to do with that footage? Uh, unfortunately, you're not asking me a question. You're telling me that you don't allow something. Yeah, yeah we don't allow it. We're not, we're not, we don't allow people to come in and take photographs in and around our facility. So all I'm asking you is, yeah, but you what are you doing with that footage? What I'm saying to you is... Right? No, no, no. I'm just asking you a question. Yeah. What are you doing no, with that I, footage? I'm answering step by step everything you're saying. So at the moment, you're telling me you, you no, don't no, no, allow it. No, no, you're answering. It. You're questioning what I'm asking. I've asked you a question. What are you doing with that footage? Okay, if I say to you, I'm not going to allow you to cross that road, right? If you want to cross that road, you can do it. All I'm asking you is what you're doing with the footage. Yeah, and I know what you're asking, but okay, so you're not being you reasonable. You're not being reasonable. Ask, ask the question. Unfortunately, ask another question. I'm just asking you a simple question is you're taking footage over our facility I'm asking what you're going to do with that footage. Okay, what I'm going to do... Did you ask permission? Did you come in and say that I'd like to take some photographs of your facility or some video footage and I'm going to use it for XYZ? You Did do realise that? You do realise that by coming out to a member of the public saying you need permission to fly your drone over our building, that sounds ridiculous. No, no, no. It does. I'm just asking you the question. No, is, you're not. You're telling me that I can't do something. I'm not saying you can't do it. Oh, that's it I'm then. Asking, I can do it, can't I? No, I'm asking you what you're doing with that footage. Where I know is you that are. going to appear? But do you know if I start telling you too much, that'll be me volunteering information to you while you're not being reasonable with me. You're, oh, you're... I've seen guys like you before. I'm just asking you a very simple question. Don't need to get into all the complicated what you're coming out with. Do I need... Am I'm I required to tell you? I'm you. Yeah, am I required to tell you? I need to know where that's going to appear. Well, that's your need, not my need. Okay. I don't need to tell you, but you need to know. Right, so what I'm going to ask is, please don't do that again. We're I'm, I'm just you, changing the battery, that's we're all. We're asking, you know, it was up and you just said, I'm just taking some footage. Yeah. Okay, so you wasn't just resetting and charging the battery at all. How do you know that the battery's not just gone flat? Because you've just said... Okay, let, let me try and just, explain it to you. I don't okay. need you to explain. I'm here. I'm just I'm asking, taking... I've asked you, you're not going to give that information up, so the conversation is over, isn't it? 
you're not going to tell us what you're going to do with that footage. Please don't ask a member of the public not to fly a drone over your property. You own the land, you don't own the airspace. You cannot Listen. tell people what to do in the airspace. But what you do with that footage... Is up to me. ...could put us in a difficult position. Why could it? There's nobody... I've come here, you finish work at half one, yeah? No. On a Friday? No, It clearly says it on the sign. No, no, no. Let me show you then. I've chosen today to do this when there's not many people around. Right, okay. So it's going to tell me what here? It's going to tell me that the safest time for me to come and do a drone flight when there's less people around, less activity, no, 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 less no. risk to no, your no, company, no, no. That isn't what you said. is half one what on a Friday. What you said is no one works here after half one on a Friday. What does that say? The site closes, the site closes at half one. So is this not the best time to do it? No. Why not? Because you still, still out of common courtesy ask us, can we put, take some footage of your facility and what you're doing it for? I don't need to do that. All right, okay, we'll leave it there. Thank I'll you. I'll come out and ask your question. No, you've put, came out and tried to assert some sort of authority on a member of the public. You're telling me I'm, I'm not allowed to do something. Okay. You don't permit. Mind yourself. You don't permit this, you don't permit that. Your rules apply beyond them fences that don't apply on the public footpath. Yeah, but you were over our, yeah. you, your drone was over there. Airspace no. is not property, you don't look, own the airspace. Look, that's all. don't impede my space I'm now. walking backwards. Yeah, no, don't impede my space. The comments that you make are entirely up to you. I've just asked you, our common courtesy, what are you going to do with that footage? You change your tone. No, 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 it's no. Now, it's now asking, is it? No, 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 I said at the beginning. Okay, am I allowed to fly over? Are you allowed to fly yeah. over what? By law, am I allowed to fly what over? What I'm asking is what you're doing with that footage. But I'm not asking you that. So if you start answering my questions, I might start answering yours. Hold on. I've just said our business yeah. okay, is in the aerospace industry. Yeah. Yes or no, right? Yeah, so I, I want to see some products. There's a reason why we've got security gates around it. Yeah, to stop people it's, coming on it's, your land. It's, no, no, no. It's yes. to prevent risk to product going out onto the aircraft. Right? What? We are... What happens is, this, uh, the product that's made in here goes onto the aircraft, right? Yeah. So, anybody, if that product makes it onto the aircraft, that is now under threat. I don't know what you're doing that, but you could be passing that on to anybody. Access into the, into the building. For me to ask that question is perfectly a reasonable request. No, you, what you're doing with it. You're trying to say that I'm not allowed. No. I am allowed. Okay, listen. And then I said, I'm asking you, what are you doing with the footage? And you're just being unreasonable about the fact that you don't want to tell me what you're doing with it. I will tell you. I will tell you what I'm doing with the footage, but I need you to start being honest. You, can a drone flyer fly a 249 gram drone over your property or not? Can By it? law, lawfully. Lawfully? I'll go and look into it. Well, I'm telling you, I'll go look if we that. got over that hurdle, then I'll tell you where the video is going to go. But you're not going to tell me anyway. Well, can we yeah. get over the hurdle? About over a, two, the hurdle of what? a 249 gram drone yeah. is allowed to fly over commercial property, including this one, because it's not near an airport and it's not near a prison. You're not allowed to fly near a prison or an airport. Right? No, but the parts that are manufactured in here go to an airport. Your privacy is not affected on the drone rules. Drone rules does not take company privacy this into account. This is why you're here, is you're waiting to be challenged on that so you can go through the fact that you know bits and pieces. But what, well, I've I've asked I you don't want you coming out trying to stop drone flyers doing what they're allowed to do by law. Okay. And well, you I tried did. it. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. So we have a witness here. This is the witness. We have a, and there's a witness here. Okay, I asked you a question which was, what are you doing with the footage? And you're refusing to give me that information. I'm willing to tell you. You're not, now you're changing. You're yeah, the one who said, I, I, I refuse to give I you that. I want you to back down on what no, you, you're no, trying no, to, no, 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 look no. at all these signs. What's this all about? Why are, you, why are you trying to impose some sort of ruling on a member of the public? You've got Listen, no right. Absolutely we have. We've got what, so, to put that sign on there. Well, try it then. I'm, no. going to take, I'm going to take this drone over right now. Let's see what right you've got to stop, okay, to stop so me. Okay, give me your name then. Okay, let's see what right you've got. If you think you can stop members of the public flying drones over, let's put it to the test. Else, your sign looks, it makes you look ridiculous. If you can't stop it, no, what, why even you, say it? Listen, all I'm asked, I've asked you a question, what are you doing with that footage? You're refusing to give that information over, okay? You want to spell out whatever you want to do, that's up to you. I've asked you reasonably now. What are you doing with the footage? All right. I'm glad we, you said now. No, no, no. You're not going to hand that information over. You don't want to tell us. And you, maybe you are doing it with something completely innocent. But we have got a business to protect as well. And making sure that the people who are the end users of our product are safe as well. 
If you want to put that in jeopardy, that's entirely up to you. You should keep all your secret stuff indoors, and when you're loading it onto vehicles, the vehicle should reverse you, undercover. You do. Yeah. If you're leaving anything that can be visible from the air, that's you. So, they think that they have the right to stop a drone flying over. So, just to prove a point, we shall fly the drone over. And shall we try and see who they're calling on their mobile phone? Will we be able to zoom in to see who is being dialed? No, we won't. You know, how ridiculous is that? Their argument is, we've got sensitive stuff on display. So, due to that fact, nobody can fly over our building. We will restrict the airspace with signs and people, staff that will come out and tell the drone flyers that you are not allowed to fly over this section because we have not took care and consideration to keep sensitive stuff covered over. That's why signs like this that don't even make sense should not be put up. Well that's about it from Collins Aerospace here at Leighton Buzzard. Despite us choosing the most quiet possible time when the site is closed after half one on a Friday it's still not good enough is it? They still come out trying to assert their authority on a member of the public out on a public footpath. They put these ridiculous signs up. No fly zone for drones. Flying with 500 foot off this property. The sign don't even make sense. Even if it did make sense, it's a load of garbage. Because a 249 gram drone can fly over commercial. Hello mate. Hello mate. Thank you for watching. Thank you very much. Great work, man. Anthony Betts there. Quickly stopped to grab his keyring. I was just about to hide the keyring. <laughs> and then a viewer came and grabbed it off me. So the DJ Audit's keyring location on this one is just underneath that hat there. I do think I'm being watched, so I won't lift it up. But yes, if you are in the area and you do want a DJ Audit's keyring, and you're one of the first to watch the video, <laughs> you gotta be quick, <laughs> then that's where it is. Just under the hat there. So thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.